Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Flagging a message for yourself in Outlook creates a to-do item that reminds you to follow up on the message. After completing the task, you can mark it as completed and clear the flag. When you flag a message, Outlook places a little flag icon next to the messages that require follow-up. You can specify an action required to complete the follow-up. You can flag both messages you send and messages you receive. To flag a received message for follow-up, open the Inbox folder and select the message to flag for follow-up. Then click the Follow-up button that appears in the Tags button group on the Home tab of the ribbon. In the drop-down menu that appears, then select the type of flag to apply. You can also use quick clicks in the inbox to flag a message. To do this, hold your mouse pointer over a message in the inbox. A small icon of a flag then appears in the upper right corner of the message window. Click the flag icon to flag the message. For more advanced flagging options, right-click the flag icon to choose when to set the flag for follow-up from a drop-down menu of choices. To flag a message that you are sending, create the mail message as usual. Then click the Follow-up button in the Tags button group on the Message tab of the ribbon in the Message window. Then select the Custom command from the drop-down menu to open the Custom dialog box. In this dialog box, to flag the message for yourself, check the Flag for Me checkbox. Then click the drop-down arrow next to the Flag to field to select a type of follow-up for this message. To set a start date and a due date for the flag, click the drop-down to the right of the Start Date and Due Date fields. Then select the desired dates from the calendar drop-downs. To also create a reminder for yourself, check the Reminder checkbox. Then select the desired time at which you want the reminder to appear in Outlook. To flag this message for the recipient, check the Flag for Recipients checkbox. Then use the Flag to drop-down and the Reminder checkbox to flag and set a reminder for the recipients of this message. Click the OK button when you are finished to set the flag for the message and return to the inbox. Later, to indicate that you followed up with the message, you can mark the flag as completed in Outlook. To do this, click the icon of the flag at the right end of the flagged message in your inbox to turn it into a check mark. Doing this also removes it from your to-do list. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.